If he doesn't show up the way you want, leave and find a new guy who shows up exactly the way you want them to show up. Wrong! Guys, have you heard advice like this from dating coaches? That if the guy doesn't make effort, if the guy doesn't plan dates, if the guy doesn't stop dating other people, you move on, you find a new man, because that man isn't showing up for you the way you want. Of course he isn't. He isn't showing up for you the way you think about him. He isn't showing up for you because of the way you think about you. So if you think guys are shitty and you need to move from guy to guy because some of them will use you, some of them won't make effort, some of them are low effort, some of them are bad daters, some of them are multiple dating a whole lot of girls on websites and it's not just you, that's exactly what your reality will be with that person. They'll still be on Tinder dating a whole lot of girls. They won't make the effort. They'll be low effort. You'll have to plan the dates. You'll have to leave because he's not showing up the way you're thinking he is. Everyone in your reality is simply a reflection of your dominant thinking about yourself, your concept of yourself, your self-concept. And if you've heard videos on here about self-concept, a lot of you aren't even being taught it correctly. It's your concept of you in love that reflects out and that person will show up how you think about them and how you think about you. Please stop watching dating tactics or anyone who tells you to leave the person because they're not showing up the way you want. They're not showing up that way because you think of them that way, because you think of you a certain way. You think you're gonna get rejected? You will. You think that they're gonna want other girls? They'll be dating multiple girls. If you think they won't make any effort, they won't plan the dates, they fucking won't. And then you'll have to leave and you'll find the next guy and he'll be making an effort at first and then slowly but surely, he won't make the effort and you'll be like, oh, all guys are the same. Why do I end up with these flaky guys? You end up with those flaky guys because of your dominant assumption that you don't get catered to, that guys don't show up for you, that don't care enough, that don't make enough effort, that you're not chosen by them, that you have to people please and you have to do and you have to cater to them. That's your thinking and they're reflecting it. Have you ever had a person turn up great at first and then they change? They're changing because of your thinking, okay? If you don't get this, guys, please do follow my content because a lot of you are really lost and you're watching the wrong content and you're not understanding what you're doing wrong when you're dating.